Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're checking out Parish Brewing Company's Atticus Atlas IPA. So Atticus Atlas, what a tongue twister. I could barely get that out in the intro. Um, cool can art, just very minimalist, just cream colored sticker with a kind of shiny butterfly thing on it. Mm -hmm. Like a copper butterfly. Yeah, it looks kind of cool. Pretty fancy. It's pretty high class. It says number three, so maybe this is the third revision of the beer, I'm guessing. Could be, yeah. Um, triple IPA. No other information to be had on it. Actually, I think it is the three skins for the rendition because this came out in 2017. And we got oh, wow. It in 2019, so that would make sense why it's the third rendition. Okay. It's three years away. Got it. Well, it pours definitely a hazy, sort of orange juicy color. This looks like straight orange juice. It smells like just dank hops and, and oats. Yeah, dank, juicy, oaty hops. Thick, it smells thick, like thick hops. <laughs> it has like a nice smooth creamy head to it too. Mmm, some micro bubbles happen in here. Lacing looks good. Mm -hmm. Just really decadent, feeling beer. We're gonna dive into this one and see what it tastes mm -hmm. like. I'm gonna guess that it's gonna be another one of those Odie bombs. Oh yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's lighter than I thought it would be. For a triple IPA, that's kind of light. I'm gonna guess that this one is about six and a half to, well, no, I think it's gonna be about like 7% IPA, uh, IBV. Do you know? I believe it's eight or nine. Is it seven. really? Wow, yes. jeez. It doesn't say, so I have no idea. That's a triple, so I mean, I, I couldn't, that's in the realm of possibility, I suppose. It mm -hmm. hides it pretty well if it is. Yeah. My experience drinking doubles and triples, doubles start at eight, triples start at nine. Mm. And higher, if not 10. Yeah, it's definitely a, a good triple IPA. Mm. Yeah, no, this is, this is good. Definitely really juicy, kind of creamy tasting too. Mm -hmm. That thickness Smooth. gives it that creamy taste. Mm. Hides alcohol really well. There's no bite to it. You can taste a little bit of alcoholiness to it, but it's like very balanced in the mix mm -hmm. of what's going on here. Really well balanced, really flavorful. There's not much else to say about it. Parrish uh, doing good things over there in Broussard, Louisiana. I think the hype around this brewery, because this is the second beer that we've had from them, that we've been like, okay. I think the hype is real. Yeah, so far, I've really liked both beers. We've had a triple IPA and a coffee stout, two completely different styles, mm -hmm. and both have been just- Really good. Just on point. So, I don't know. Hype train coming. All right, guys, well, that does it from us. If you're interested in more craft beer reviews or craft beer event coverage, be sure to click the subscribe button and hit the little bell to be notified when new videos come out. Until next time, stay crafty. Cheers.